Ma me la nga keli zwe za ke li supe za zela je so ke molo ke wa ka Hi family, welcome back to our home, our channel. Um, let us continue with our today's video. But before we go there, can you please read something from the book of uh, Luke chapter 12. The Bible reads, in the meantime, when, oh, Luke chapter 12, verse 4. Yeah, I want to start from verse 4. Uh, but probably until nine ten. Yeah, nine actually. I tell you, uh, Luke chapter four from uh, four to nine. Yes, I tell you, my friends, do not fear those who kill the body, and after that have nothing more that they can do. But I will warn you, whom to fear. Fear him who, after he has killed, has authority to cast into hell. Yes, I tell you, fear him. Are not five sparrows sold for two pennies? And not one of them is forgotten before God. Why? Even the hairs of your head are all numbered. Fear not. You are of more value than many many sparrows and then in verse 8 the bible reads and i tell you everywhere everyone who acknowledges me before men the son of man also will acknowledge acknowledge before the angels of god but the one who denies me before men will be denied before the angels of god father god we thank you for your beautiful word we have heard you lord Thank you for your comfort. Thank you, Lord, for your assurance that man only can destroy body, but they cannot destroy the soul. Lord, we cannot fear man who can tamper with flesh, but we fear you, Lord, for we know that you have authority to cast into hell. Lord God, may you give us the spirit of boldness to continue to proclaim your great deeds. In the land of the living. In Jesus' name, amen. Hi, guys. Um, the scripture read. <laughs> I tell you, my friends, do not fear those who kill the body. You see, one of the greatest things I've learned and I tend to love more about God and the word. God doesn't come forth with lies. And God does is not God of confusion. God is not gonna is not saying in this particular scripture, you know, Jesus is not saying uh, Jesus is not saying, um, I tell you, my friends, do not fear those who kill the body. You see, uh, recognize something here. I tell you, my friends, do not fear those who kill the body. That statement on its own is clear. It doesn't mean there are people who cannot kill the body. It doesn't mean there is no one who can kill the body. But rather fear the one who is able to, to not only deal with the body, but he can deal with you for eternity and he can cast you into hell. You see, now, this one with so much authority is in us. You see, this one 
is in us. That's why we shouldn't fear. And he later goes and says, I, uh, they have nothing to do to you anymore. Like, you know, after that, have nothing more that they can do. But I'll, I will warn you whom to fear. Fear him who after he has killed has authority to cast into hell. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. Yes, they are there. Yes, they can kill the body, but there will be nothing after that they can do. But he can not only kill, but he can cast into hell. And also the importance of not being ashamed. You know, Paul says, I'm not ashamed of the gospel for it is the power of God. We are not ashamed of this Jesus. We will shout. It doesn't matter what the enemy brings to our flesh. It doesn't matter how we struggle about it, you know, along the way. You know, that is why I always say also it's important to pray even for pastors, you know, because they're still humans, <laughs> you know. Uh, yeah, they are overseers of different churches, but they're still, they still fall into temptation. You see, we, we need to stand with each other. In prayer because all the devil wants is us is after us but we have one with the final authority um, I'm not telling this story to scare anybody hence I started with a weapon as you know I was there I did that blah 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 you know we give right to the devil to do things to us. You know, we, we open doors, you know, uh, that that all these demonic spirits used to enter in our lives. We are so, you know, we wouldn't be saved if it was not the act of God. You know, it because men, we are hostile people. People are so stubborn. I'm telling you, you know, we are stubborn. We, we love what we love, we love. Possibility, what we love, we love. And we, we, it's, hard for, it's, it's hard for us sometimes to change. You know, flesh will tell you, man. The flesh will tell you to, manage. wait, 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 wait. I'm still holding on to this. You know, you even see that when, when you, are, you think you're in love with someone and it's last. You don't want to listen to anybody when they even give you advice. You will never listen to anybody because your flesh is already deep. You are in Benekan, pakat, pakat, and you don't want to listen to anybody. So here is the thing with fornication. A sister will come and say, my dear, fornication is not okay. You see, fornication will rob you the joy of your salvation. Fornication will rob you uh, the, the beautiful eternal place that the master has, has prepared for you. And I'll be here because, I mean, the blood body is still telling me, you know, my sister, the, 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 the adultery is, and this sister will do it out of love and in love. You know, they will come to you, be it their friends, be it your family, be it, you know, people that know you, they will come and say, hey, my sister, hey, 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 hey. I'm telling you, hey, people, I'm, I, I'm, I, 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 let me repeat this. I'm not telling my story only as a nyanga that has never lived outside Bunyang. Hey, people, I have... I think there was a comment below was talking about uh, scandals and I'm a bag of scandals. I'm a bag of a lot of shame a lot of things that the enemy can just use and hold me and say, Hey, where now you, hey, hey, I'm freed and I don't fear you. Yes. I've done them all, but hey, 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 I know who I am now. Sorry. Sorry. Try next door. So, we, 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 I'm talking about things that I know it will be so, I'm telling you, cheating a partner. Hey, hey, yo, hey, you will feel like, hi, boy. you know, you forget the day you met the particular part, your partner or your husband or your, your wife. You, you forget your wife whom you, you took your cows to if you did the cow. A ceremony you forget you are the one who said will you marry me you know <laughs> you forget 
you you forget that you are the one that was chasing her you forget how much you promised her heaven and earth sometimes men do that because you have seen this one the shiny one because your 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 wife or your fiance or your partner i cannot detail because people have different you know you you forget the partner that you have because maybe their skin is drying up with age and then there's this young ones with the shiny popping skin no cellulite you name it they're all gloomy and all that they look like dolls <laughs> you forget and you fall into temptation and after falling into temptation you get deeper into something that you do not know you see them Okay, I don't want to, to put things out there in order for people to look at people different now, you see. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. That's so wrong. Because if I do that, people now will start looking at people. with. But I'll just give a general uh, warning to men, you see. Uh, God... I've repented before you, but even you, Baba, you know these hands caused a lot of distractions with regards to relationships. Uh, there is no, there is nothing as painful as a woman frustrated in her marriage because of someone who has kept something in her womanhood to hold on to, to a man. All because that man, that man, never mind the mistress, never mind the other girlfriend, that man himself invited trouble for himself. Out there, there are a lot of things, okay? Out there, there are things that sit in the womb of a woman, ne? in order for women to you know some women have made it to themselves that they are womanhood is their uh, check uh, checkbook their atm their standard bank and their absa their fnb their swiss banks it, it it you cannot change that you can try to talk to them you can try to preach you know you can and some they According to them, they have valid reasons to be doing that. You understand? But um, the what comes out of the 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 measures they will go to, the you know the length they will go to in order for them to to succeed in their missions in life. Because a lot of young girls have been used as uh, primary uh, agents of darkness because of bodies you know, and they've caused a lot of havoc in people's marriages. They've caused, caused a lot, a lot, a lot of havoc in men, men's health. Do you know how painful it is for a pastor to keep praying, fasting for someone that has signed a deal with the devil? Do you know how painful it is for, for a pastor to be fasting for someone who, who willingly, you know, knowing the word, you know, knowing the word, it, it's not easy, I know, but you do it, leave your wife, and you come. You know, the, one of other things I've seen that God is jealous of a weeping woman. That one, yeah, you know, I've experienced it. God is jealous. God, God is a precious jewel, you know, <laughs> apples in God's eyes. You know, God is jealous of women. <laughs> God he doesn't want this. They'll come because women will come to God full force bringing their marriage in tears in the bedroom a woman will cry in the kitchen a woman will cry, cry in the toilet a woman a woman will not stop she will cry and when you are there and when you fall in a wrong dig you fall in someone i'm telling you someone who has something inside and then you go hit hey hit hit they call it they call it umlil stove something it's the the warmth that you, you don't feel at home anymore right that that warmth was was made you know 
apart from maybe she may be a bit younger, no kids, uh, high man intact, whatever, whatever, whatever. But like I usually tell women, uh, stop thinking that having kids uh, damages you. Take care of your womanhood. It is so easy to take care of your womanhood. Your womanhood is like an engine of a car. As much as you service your car, you need to service your, your womanhood in order for your husband not to go out and find fire in next door when you your car is leaking. Why is your car leaking? It's because you do not take your car to a gynecologist for service. You need to visit gynecologists. Sometimes when we are in marriages, we forget ourselves. And these women have clients, have candidates, have people coming in because people are looking for warmth. You know, they are like heaters waiting for people who are cold. So do not let your husband do. There are a lot of doors that we, we self open for, for, for demons to come and torment our lives. You see, so now I want to talk about a man that goes and sleeps with someone that has marks on him private part has marks that you cannot see some of the things they she drinks you see the 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 one thing that they like using this young uh, they put the thing in the blood you see because she cannot go around and that thing is old fashioned let me also help on that highlight putting on your food like that it's old fashioned it's primary witchcraft what they do now they put it in their body systems in order to attract a lot you see and they stay with it <laughs> you know if there's a researcher who wants to research just visit universities you know you visit universities visit these young women you know do your research you will see where witchcraft is sitting and your man goes vata inside and then he starts having uh problems with the two you know it's no longer it's no longer strongly it goes you know he doesn't know why because something kissed you when you were inside there because that woman would, was dedicated to something in order for it to keep making money. You know, there are different, different types that don't speak of these level A ones where they go, they, them, they, no, they are, those are level one. The ones now that break, cause commotions in people's marriages. You are men. You know, men, I always say, if you look at your manhood, how it was designed, it tells you how it was designed. You see, a woman's own, it's secret. It's like this. It's inside. You see, it's like a hole. So from this hole comes a lot. If you read uh, the book of Proverbs there, you know, just read and listen to what an adulterous woman can, can be able to do, uh, to make a man do. You know, and this thing for women is like a hole. And from that hole, good or bad can come out. So you need to be careful because when you go there, you take the first time you go out. You take the second time you go out. You go, you keep collecting. You go to the doctor. They will be giving antibiotic. They will be treating probably different sexual trans, uh, all these transmitted diseases, whatever, whatever. And you keep repeating it. In the process, you know, there's soul ties, there's whatever, whatever, but the recapitulation of taking, going inside a hole that has a, 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 a fire that is being burned, you know, that is fueled by by something of the dark kingdom, the, the effects, the after effects is not easy. It's not going to work how it's supposed to work because you have eaten from a dirty pot. Who caused that? You did. You come home, you can't perform your husband duties because you have finished yourself outside. All because you want us to taste uh, that, you know, the, the doll. These dolls are inno not innocent. I, 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 you know, these dolls are dangerous. 
You see these dots you see? They are dangerous. They are very dangerous. And it, let me tell you, some of the things that I've learned, God, uh, we, you know, when you read about God chastening, chastening us, I, I believe God, some of the things he will let you, he will watch you, you know, because he has given you over to your own urges. You know you shouldn't be committing adultery. You know you shouldn't be fornicate. You know that you said I do. Nobody forced you to say I do. You took that woman and said I do. You said when you were saying I do, you said I'll uh, for uh, um, through uh, till death do us apart, right? And that woman's body changes and everything and everything. Instead of you trying to fix your marriage, you feel like. The flower that you see outside is better than uh, a stem of a tree. You see, let's just say a, a, a trunk of a tree that, that you have because you have ignored and neglected it to become like that. Outside, there is dangerous oils. Outside, there is danger. There are dangerous things that women stay with in order for them to be seen fresh all the time. You see, to, to be seen young all the time, to be seen, women will do anything in their powers if their body is an asset to get money. Women will pay you. <laughs> yes. Women can pay. Women, a woman will take money from this boyfriend and come pay me in my Dumba for, for this man. Both of them, people's husbands. And what I will do, and I will make sure that this, because at that time, that is my spiritual child. And my spiritual child, when she has money, she comes, she spoils me, she loves me. So we need to be careful as men. You'll start having problems with your manhood simply because you went and ate from a dirty pot. You hear your wife nagging, and you think she's nagging. If I were you, I would listen to those nagging. Because out there, it's dangerous. And you know it. You will try to hold it, my brother. You know it. You know You, you know it. <laughs> you will say you are holding it, man. It's, it's no long. It's just marshmallow. It has met something that I, I made a long time ago. It has met something that uh, uh, one uh, 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 them did. I can't mention their names. And, you know, yeah. It will, it will, it will, it will, it's going to meet. Imagine getting inside a locked house. They open that that house without telling you anything, and you, there's a the, there's a lion. Imagine thinking that you are the one you are you are you are you are doing it with someone, and it's warm inside, only to find that you are being sucked by something that's sitting inside. Hey, and you come out, you start having problems. Pastor prays. You give hand to, to, to you, you give a go ahead for the spirit of these things to come into you. So you rather, you know, if I come here and say, hey, it's easy to overcome certain things by yourself, I, I'll be lying. But it's easy when you do it with Jesus. It's better sometimes to apply that. You know, I, I, I've also learned that the easiest way to, 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 to make the word work for you is because it works, it's power on its own. So if I read that, hey, it's better to fear the one that can cast into hell. You know, it, it will, with time, it will help you. You know, it will transform you. It will help you uh, put things into perspective that, okay, I cannot uh, do th things or entertain things that will send me to hell. Your wife's nagging. Maybe a, 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 an alarm for you, my brother. If you don't want to have waste problems, 
if you don't want to have uh, erection problems, if you don't want to have all these problems, please stay faithful. And don't marry if you are not ready. Because marriage is ministry. And from marriage, a lot is expected. You see, going and breaking your wife's uh, heart and everything, God will always answer. This applies also with women. But there's a lot of men with a problem in their manhood. Simply because they ate from a black pot. A pot that has a, a very dangerous demon that is eating out men, you know. And they don't know. You think, hey, she's so hot. She's so good. No, it was not her. Something inside was, was, was sucking you out. You were giving a voluntary giving your your kids to that thing. Women do it. Women are dangerous. Especially women that have told themselves that I am a bank. Don't do that to yourself. Don't do that to yourself. <laughs> you know? And I've met a lot of men. You find a man doesn't have a child. He is trying to prove that he doesn't have fertility problems. He goes around sleeping around like that, like that, like that, like that. Causing more havoc to himself. You are eating from black pots. I've met men with... Uh, uh, Issues, you see, they have health issues and they want to prove they are, that they are strong. Doctor will diagnose. You see, doctor, <laughs> doctor doesn't have stress. You come to doctor's surgery, doctor asks, huh, what, what do you say is a problem? You are going to give doctor your symptoms and doctor will diagnose. Doctor, what is done in the spiritual realm will manifest in the physique. With the dark kingdom, it is there. I will do it. Destroy this body. Because Jesus is clear. The thief comes to steal, kill, and destroy. I, the Lord, have come to give life, life in abundance. When he says in abundance, it, it means even after death, there is life promised to us. Is it not better? Please, my beloved my brother, they may look beautiful. In my language, we say, Don't look at a beautiful uh, fruit, you know? You just look at the fruit and say, Wow, it's so beautiful. Only to find that inside, it is rotten. So you need to be faithful. It is your duty as a child of God and as a husband. It is not only women who cheat, but men have done it worse. Because you see, a woman's a womanhood is a whole and yours is like um, um, a pipe that pulls. Because it's God. See on top there, that pipe doesn't only spray out. It takes in. Please, you are causing havoc for your own families. You tomorrow, you will say, hey, my wife has acne. My wife has problems with her skin issues. You know, you, you invite problems. You go to the black pot, enter, take that, that very same tool of yours, put it in someone who's innocent. And remember, the black pot there entertains its it rules for its owner. So once you put it in another woman, the owner of the black pot is angry, working against an innocent woman. You, you understand? 
her God will fight for sure. That one is surety. But in the process, the flesh is going to suffer. All because of you. If you want your manhood to remain strong, healthy, guard where you eat, my brother. People are evil out there. Uh, I think there are Nigerians who say, not all that glitters is gold. Some other things have painted gold on top. So please, be careful where you use your pipe. Because you may use your pipe in the wrong pot and you will get burnt. I love you. God loves you more. Let us pray, my brother. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you, God, for Jesus. We thank you for the deliverer. We thank you for the healer. Lord, he bore our infirmities. Upon him, he took all our transgressions. Lord, we thank you. That by his stripes, we are healed. Father God, the Bible tells us that you started with men, Lord. It says you started creating Adam. Our leaders, our heads. Baba, in the name of Jesus, the ones that we need to submit to. This morning, we commit them before you in the name of Jesus. Because it shows us also that you created a woman as a helper. For this particular gender. Father, this morning we are praying for we are praying for our brothers. We are praying for our fathers. We are praying for our uncles. We are praying for our sons, our our nephews. Lord, in the name of Jesus. We say, Lord, we commit them back to you, Father, because you said a woman is a helper. We are standing as helpers, oh God, to commit them before you, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Mighty God, may you give them the, the 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 spirit of boldness lord boldness of knowing their own authority and standing in your word as man baba god we also pray that you must open their eyes to see lord and be able to overcome temptation because you have already overcome for us father god we pray this morning that you help men to mold them in order for them to become good leaders in the name of jesus Jesus, mighty God, may you always make an escape for them. If they are tempted in the name of Jesus, may you make man, God, honor their own vows in the name of Jesus. We pray for your children, oh God. We pray for your sons, that mighty God, a every weapon formed against them shall not prosper in the name of Jesus. We pray for wisdom, understanding, and knowledge. In the name of Jesus, Lord, we pray that you deliver those, Lord, that got themselves caught by their own acts. In the name of Jesus, you are God that is able to free people. In the name of Jesus, we bring every curse, we bring every bondage, we bring, Father God, every woman that has used evil against any marriage before. For you in the name of Jesus, mighty God, may your sons be freed from the clutches of Jezebels. In the name of Jesus, we thank you, God, because we know that you are God that remains in his word and brings it to fulfillment. In Jesus' name, we pray and we thank you, Lord. Amen and amen.